Hi everyone, this is Vinayadu. Today our topic is to find out radial and transverse acceleration. In the last class, what we find? We find out uh, radial and transverse velocity. In that class, we have to explain uh, these values, how to get x equal to r cos theta and how to get y equal to r sin theta. Then we find out dx by dt and uh, dy by dt. Now, our aim is to find out d square x by dt square. This d square x by dt square can be written as d by dt of dx by dt. What is the value of dx by dt? What is, the, what is this value? Cos theta into dr by dt minus r sin theta into d theta by dt. Now, we separate these two terms. Then, what we get here? d by dt of cos theta into dr by dt dr by dt minus of d by dt of r sin theta into d theta by dt. Okay, now let us say this is u and this is v. Here also let us say this is u and this is v. Now we applied uv formula uh, u into dv plus v into du. See this one cos theta into derivative of derivative of dr by dt. What we get here d square r by dt square plus v. V means dr by dt into derivative of cos theta we get minus sin theta again theta derivative we get d theta by dt over here now this one u constant derivative dv dv v constant now du here what we get here minus minus sin theta into d theta by dt let us say constant then the derivative of r what we get here dr by dt minus of minus of now r constant then derivative d by dt of sin theta into d theta by dt again we applied here uv formula here, let us say sin theta is let us say u and d theta by dt let us say v. Then what we get here? See this one cos theta into d square r by dt square. Here minus of plus minus sin theta d theta by dt into dr by dt. Here also minus sin theta d theta by dt into dr by dt. Then what we get here? 2 sin theta d theta by dt into dr by dt. Now we applied uv formula and multiply with r. Then what we get here minus r sin theta into derivative of d theta by dt. What we get here d square theta by dt square. And uh, another one now d theta by dt constant then derivative of sin theta what we get here cos theta again theta derivative d theta by dt finally what we get here here r cos theta into d theta by dt whole square okay now this term and this term what we come in here cos theta this term and this term what we come in here sin theta then what we write here d square r by dt square minus r into d theta by dt whole square into cos theta minus minus here two terms nici minus common this end of here two terms in end of common this taro minus common this the what we get here. to d theta by dt into dr by dt uh, here mm, plus r into d square theta by dt square 
into sin theta okay and this is the value of uh, d square x by dt square now we find out uh, d square y by dt square d square y by dt square can be written as d by dt of dy by dt what is the value of dy by dt dy by dt equal to sin theta into dr by dt plus r cos theta into d theta by dt now we separate these two terms then what we get here d by dt of sin theta into dr by dt plus d by dt of r cos theta into d theta by dt now we applied uv formula here and then what we get here sin theta into d square r by dt square plus uh, sin theta derivative cos theta theta derivative d theta by dt then what we get here cos theta into d theta by dt into dr by dt now here we applied uv formula let us say ru and uh, remaining term let us say v then what we get here cos theta into d theta by dt the derivative for what we get here dr by dt plus r into d by dt of cos theta into d theta by dt again we applied here uv formula now what we get here sin theta into d square r by dt square sin theta into d square r by dt square here cos theta d theta by dt dr by dt here also cos theta d theta by dt dr by dt then what we get here 2 cos theta into d theta by dt into dr by dt now we applied uv formula here and then what we get first step? r into r into let us say cos theta constant then derivative of d theta by dt what we get here d square theta by dt square plus r into now d theta by dt constant then cos theta derivative we get minus sin theta minus sin theta theta derivative d theta by dt d theta by dt into d theta by dt what we get here d theta by dt whole square now we come on these two terms by cos theta and uh, these two terms we come on sin theta then what we get here from these two terms d square r by dt square d square r by dt square minus r into d theta by dt whole square come on this day what we get here sin theta plus plus we come on cos theta then what we get here 2 into d theta by dt into dr by dt plus here we get r into d square theta by dt square into cos theta this is the value of d square y by dt square from cartesian coordinate system acceleration can be written as a bar equal to d square x by dt square along x axis plus d square y by dt square along y axis now we put these two values d square x by dt square value and d square y by dt square value yeah. here here the term is d square r by dt square minus r into d theta by dt whole square into cos theta i cap here sin theta j cap then what we come on from these two terms d square r by dt square minus r into d theta by dt whole square and either man common this the ikkada man kind sir migulutundante i cap cos theta plus here j cap sin theta okay 
from these two terms this is sin theta i cap this is cos theta j cap from these two terms what we write here 2 into d theta by dt into dr by dt plus r into d square theta by dt square into minus i cap sin theta plus j cap cos theta in the last class already i, I will explain r cap can represents cos theta i cap plus sin theta j cap theta cap represents sin theta minus i cap sin theta plus j cap cos theta now this equation this equation compared with a bar equal to a r into r cap plus a theta into theta cap here this is r cap this is theta cap the coefficient of r cap the coefficient of r cap represents radial acceleration therefore radial acceleration a r equal to what we get here d square r by dt square minus r into d theta by dt whole square and another one the coefficient of theta cap represents transverse acceleration our transverse acceleration therefore our transverse acceleration a theta equal to r into d square theta by dt square plus 2 into d theta by dt into dr by dt